Hey everyone, Xenozim here. Welcome back to more Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team DX. Last time, we did some missions and this time we're doing some more and hopefully getting what I was hoping to appear last time to appear. Oh my god. Might as well just check. I was hoping that this wouldn't be as much of an issue. Anyways, uh, the episodes might start being a bit more spaced out at a certain point, probably due to just how things are going on in life. Thankfully we're just getting we're getting closer and closer to the end of the main story so this won't be too much of an issue. Thankfully this will not be going slowly. This will probably be one of the shorter episodes if things go as I think they will. Da -da -da -dun. There isn't much else to say until the next part comes in, which is an annoying thing. Meet one of the weakest Pokemon in existence and then just run. Sorry for sighing so much. I'm a little bit drained today. What are you doing? Every really?
so I'm literally trying to think of what to talk about because really there really isn't there really is not much to talk about. That's a good effect. Last room I went into, of course. Uh. Well, I was surprised. Let's get rid of Dust Ox. Because Dust Ox only has Gust. <sighs> Finally. The Protectian, that's actually not as good as it was in the original games. I do want to talk about that. That's actually something I wanted to talk about, but... I didn't want to talk about it until we got it. Keep cacking it, cack, cack, lilla, cack, near. This is a lot of pressing A. Some an actual, some actual, some actual proper good experience. Rank up to silver. Some really good items. So sorry if you're hearing that. Uh, Thank God. Oh, wow, another earthquake. Huh. I guess it settles down. There have been a lot of earthquakes lately. No, there haven't. Oh, hi, you're up early, you know. Did you notice the earthquake earlier? It's hard to get decent sleep when there are so many earthquakes. Hey. Oh, Lombre, what's the matter? We need you at the square. Everyone's gathering there. Is something wrong? I'm not sure. Shiftry's calling everyone out. He's getting the upper RC teams to come. Zeno, let's go. Oh, wow, look at all the Pokemon. Looks like they sent out to a lot of rescue sent out to a lot of rescue teams for help. 
I've seen some pretty famous leaders from faraway places. That's Shiftry. I wonder what he's planning to do with all of his rescue teams. Clearly not to beat them up, considering there's a ride on. There's a ride on. Not ride on. There's a cipher. There is a ride on there, but I don't know why it's a ride on. Cipher's the one that's worrying. I don't know why Bellsworth's here. Can I uh, get everyone's attention here? I, uh. It's not my style to get up in front of everyone like this, and. Uh, sorry, this isn't time for that. There's big trouble! Alexam's team went underground, but they haven't returned. What? Is that true? Yes, unfortunately. Alakazam led his team underground to quell Groudon. And that's it. We haven't heard anything anything from them. To be honest, we have no idea what became of them. No idea? How is that even possible? This is Alakazam we're talking about. And they haven't come back? That's for real? That's right. It sounds like if Groudon is out of there, our league... What? It's that tough? This Pokemon named Groudon? Why don't you go underground and see for yourself? Huh? You gotta be kidding me. First magma flowing everywhere underground. I'll burn up if I go anywhere anywhere like that. Quiet, all of you. Please. There's no denying that there it is dangerous underground. It's not a place that just anyone can go. That's why I asked so many risk teams to get rid of I propose a special team be formed, but choosing the best of the best. Who will step forward? Who among us will be the heroes to take on the challenges underground? See, Zeno, this is a great opportunity. Let's go. Don't bother you guys. What's wrong with you? What's with you? Do you think we're not strong enough? You guys have gotten a lot tough. That tougher, that's for sure. But uh, there's plenty of tougher Pokemon out there. Will no one step forward? <laughs> I'll go. Whoa! B it's B Blastoise! You mean Team Hydro's Roughneck Blastoise? Those water spells in his back can rocket water so fast, but it punches through thick iron plates. <laughs> it's rumored ground on as a ground type. I'm a water type, strong as the ground type. My Hydro Pond will put ground on down in one shot. <laughs> I'll join the free t party too. Woohoo! It's Artillery. She's Team Constructor's leader. She's been she's known for persistent and clingy attacks. She ensnares foes with her tentacles and then headbutts them. She'd be nasty to face in any battle of endurance. Darlings, when I see a tough Pokemon, I want to tangle with them. <laughs> Say, how about not, not forgetting about me? I still don't know why this guy joined. Whoa, Golem! He's most brutal out of Team Rock Rumble Rock. His body's rock hard. He's supposed to be able to stand huge explosives without taking damage. If Groudon's awakened underground, that suits me fine. I'll use my rock throw to keep it buried underground. Yes, your rock fro. Your very unimpressive rock fro. Being a rock ground type. I don't know why this guy joined. The other two make sense, they're water types, but. Oh, Blastoise. Octillery. And Golem. No one can complain about this selection. I can. Why is Golem there? We will have these three rescuers head on the ground. Yeah, good choice. You're a us, make us proud. <laughs> Let's go. Win it for us. Save Alakazam's team. See, they look pretty tough, eh? Let them handle things. Hmm, they can't be helped, Zeno. You know. I wish we could have gone too, but that can't be helped. Blastoise's team can take care of things on the ground. We'll keep doing the best we can in our rescue work. <sighs> With that, next time on Pokemon Mission Dungeon Rescue Team DX, we'll be waiting for Blastoise's return. This is Zeno and Azuma of Rescue Team Mystery, signing out.